Come on, wake it up, wake it up. Wait. It's diesel talk, nigga. I already know. Hey, remember the internet is undefeated. That means in every aspect. That don't mean for the next person, to that person, to this person. It means to you too. Nigga, the internet is undefeated. That's how this nigga yellow right now. Look, look, look. Motherfuckers, look, after the after the snitching allegations and the, all that shit, nigga, nigga, come on in for the interview. Come on, come on, come on. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, nigga. Nigga in there. Nigga, that's what I'm saying. See how the acceptance is? That's why. That's why it's weird. That's why it gets tricky. That's why you can't be all in your emotions about it. Because people are going to deal with people on how they want to deal with them. Right? The interviewer nigga says, hey, you can be telling. Fuck it. I need you for the interview. I need you for my own self-benefit. This, this is what day and time we in. Come on, let me rewind this shit. Hold on, let's go. Let's look. Hey, the nigga said I need to, hey, a nigga in the comments said, I need a, you need a bigger TV, nigga, buy me one. Nigga, buy me that, hey, I need that thing like the movie theater, you know what I'm saying? So I can sit this motherfucker straight, you feel me? Nigga, buy me this shit, you know what I'm saying? I need this motherfucker way up to here, you know what I'm saying? Support the channel, boy. So whoever said that, I forgot who the fuck you are, but hey, support the channel, boy, you know what I'm saying? Say that, you know what I'm saying? Shit, hey, man, my cap, <laughs> my cash out, man. <laughs> Hey, it's Stone Diesel, boy. Hey, I need to put that shit up in the motherfucking uh, link, huh? Yeah, hey. But look, though, look what the nigga saying, though. Hey, what's up, King Yellow, man? What's what? going on, man? What's happening, guy? What y'all on? What you on? Not much, man. Nigga, you know who you are, nigga. Right now, there's a lot of good things going on in the news right now. Man, your name is out there. Every blog is posted about you, man. It's going crazy in these streets, man. He's so, gonna be like, 1090 he's gonna be like, nigga, I'm in Vegas, nigga. I'm hot as a motherfucker in this motherfucking uh, leather ass jacket, nigga. And all these tattoos on my motherfucking face don't mean nothing. This shit about to melt off when everything I got melted in the ink, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, uh, they told me uh, when I got the tattoos, they told me if I ever do some bullshit, you know what I'm saying? The ink will melt off, you know what I'm saying? When I do it, so this is what's happening, nigga. My shit's pouring, though, you know what I'm saying? So, all this shit for the. Nigga, he's melting right now. That's what I'm saying, but that nigga is melting right now in his own head. Look at his eyes, though. Look how Drop this video, and it's got a lot of the streets buzzing, man. What's up? Yeah, man, I saw that garbage. <laughs> I saw that garbage, hey. man. 1090 Jay the rap, man. You know how this shit go, man. That's the rap. He mad that I, I, I've been exposed. Tell me, Ben, get down on him. But look, 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 let's talk about that part right there, though. No, nah, but that part, though, does have a motherfucking problem and issue, too. Because these white motherfuckers and niggas saying this and that and this and that and the other. And man, come on, man. That's what I'm saying. Nigga will believe a white boy over anything. That's what's fucked up with the culture. That's why, nigga, nigga, you supposed to hammer the niggas down, nigga, when they, nigga, get up on you and they thinking like that. You feel me? But if you did wrong, nigga, you did wrong. But, nigga, on everything, nigga, we come get the messenger, too, boy. That's how this shit go. Blood, who delivering that shit? Hold on. Nigga, what the fuck, nigga? Because niggas going to question your shit, too. So this is the day and time that we not in. In this day and time, you feel me? Niggas will call out this nigga for the snitching. But, blood, niggas will get the messenger, too. Blood, who is you? Hold on. Nigga, what the fuck? You get up in the business. Boop, bop, bop, bop. Nigga, get on him, too. It don't matter if he right. Nigga, it's just the initiation, nigga, for fucking with nigga us. That's how this shit is. We don't live by the rules no more. This is where it gets tricky. We live by the rules, but niggas just throw niggas out here. Boom, he did this. Boom, fuck that. Don't matter who said it. Blood, nah, nigga. We from the rules where nigga, nigga, yeah, you kick him out there. Nigga, we turn around on you too. Nigga, right. But that doesn't happen now, man. So this is what the fuck we dealing with. So let's listen to this shit, though, anyway. <laughs> Boy. I ain't trying to switch it around and try to. Dig or find something there, you know? Like, nigga, you know what rapping is. Like, he told him a nigga that in prison, he told in prison, wrote a grievance, did all type of shit. Nay, the nigga, nay, that came in there, hit him in his The Poe told him, the police told him. This shit don't even sound right. This seem like he told on me, so I'm gonna tell on you. Uh, this shit, that's why I say, this shit is going down a drain. Don't get in no motherfucking game. Don't get, get in with no crew of niggas who even have that motherfucking mentality. Don't get into none of this shit that you see prime examples from when you look at your phone and you should be seeing what not to fucking do. That's what you should be doing. This white boy steady trying to play with all us. Come on, man. 
Now, the crazy part about it is it came out of nowhere, man. And this is the weirdest thing. Right now, we're in the middle of dropping a series it. from our interview that we just did just not too long ago. Like, we're right in the middle of dropping that interview. And then all of a sudden, all this starts to come out. The, the 1090 Jake video drops. And he's really, really coming at you. So you feel like it was a retaliation type thing? Hey, man. If you listen to how he ain't talking, man. What bro said? There was a, he had a bandana against me. He even tried to bring up, bring up some other old bullshit. The nigga just saying anything. The way that he talking, though. He aggressively talking. Oh, this is this goofy at the you, way you don't never see him saying shit like that about nobody. You know what I'm saying? If he's yeah, talking, no, no, he's saying all the time. No, he's not, and he's not saying aggressive. He's saying the regular 1090 Jake way. He's not saying aggressive, nigga. If you take that aggressive, nigga, what the fuck? Nigga, you from the shy, nigga? Come on, he's from Iraq. Come on. The fuck? He's from shy, Iraq? Get the fuck about it. He's not saying aggressive. He's saying how he says about anybody. You feel me? And, nigga, for real, see, this is how it goes. This is how it goes. When you're really mad and you're really tripping and you really don't demonstrate behind what you're talking about. Whoever the fuck mentions some vomity ass shit, to me, if I'm accused for some bullshit, nigga, I'm doing that shit too, nigga, just for even a nigga addressing it. Nigga, that's how fired up I am, nigga. On everything, I'm not gonna sit my ass down in the interview, nigga. Nah, because the interview don't compromise my motherfucking morals, nigga. On everything, it need to be known, nigga. If, if I'm not about this and I didn't do that, right? Fuck, what the fuck, nigga? You act, nigga, on everything, nigga. That's some shit. Boop, 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 boop. Get on from the nigga. So why not? But this nigga, right? He know he didn't admit to what he said. It is what it is. It is what it is. That's how I'm gonna look at shit. Niggas say it is what it is. It's almost like I'm done with the whole situation because we've been seeing this shit about to happen for a long time, and now it's happening. We in a tornado with this shit. We ain't even scared when the tornado about to stop, nigga, and drop all this shit off, and something new is about to become. We are in the middle of this shit. You feel me? This is what's happening. You know what I'm saying? Do I feel like in my own self? <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. Do I feel like in my own self is wrong? This is how I feel within my own self before we continue. I feel like this, right? If you are the type of individual and you commit these type of crimes and you do things of this type of nature where other people are implemented into whatever you do, the cause, the situation, the act, whatever it is, and you down, they down, we all agree. And the motherfuckers get wrapped up in something. And you want to give it up just to go home tonight. Whatever you want to do it for. I don't know. It could be your kids, your baby mama, your bitch, uh, uh, your wife. I don't fucking know. Whatever you want to do it for. Only only a person knows that within themselves. You're wrong. You don't, you don't, you don't do that. But in situations where you deal with the police, right? And you deal with law enforcement doing certain situations, everything that you say is not considered snitching. Now, for this old motherfucking yellow ass nigga right here, I don't know. I've never sat down with the police. Like, nigga, you sitting down, oh yeah, nigga, you going, like, nigga, what are you even sitting down? Right. Because right around us is wrong is wrong. So that's all the way wrong. When you're doing shit, no. No. But this is what I'm saying. This is where the Catch 22 comes in at with the street life. A nigga will do something and be like, don't call the police. But if a motherfucker's coughing on a chicken bone and getting ready to die, nigga's grandma, nigga's cousin, whatever in the house, a nigga's gonna dial 911. A nigga's gonna dial 911 to help their situation, right? So you call, you call the police when you need them. Because it's an emergency, right? Dial 911. Be quiet, boy. But that's what I'm saying. You, you're doing it to benefit yourself. So it's nothing wrong. But if you call them motherfuckers for any type of other situation, right? Oh, you in the wrong all of a sudden. So that's why it's just best, man, to not get involved with these type of situations when you can. Save yourself while you can. 
You feel what I'm saying? You know what it's like sitting in that cold ass motherfucking holding tank or that motherfucking cell and you're getting the way to get processed and you see here thinking that you was just in regular clothes. You was just smelling good. You was just living good. Nigga, being able to nigga, nigga, the washer, dryer, nigga, sink, nigga, stove, all this shit. You was able to do all that, but you took, you took advantage of it. For whatever reason, but when you get right there and you sit down in that tank and you get processed, you thinking it just wasn't worth it. That's what the fuck you gotta be thinking. Only way you thinking it's worth it is if you was a, just a bomb of the ass, brazy ass, going in the head ass motherfucker. First thing you should be thinking about, and the first thing most of us think about when you sit there is like, what the fuck, nigga? God damn. Like, I don't even think about right. I wouldn't even think about the code defendants or nigga whoop de whoop did this whoop de whoop. I'll be thinking about what the fuck did I get myself involved in this type of shit for? This shit, bro. bro what the fuck did I do this for? But when you go, you probably sitting in that motherfucking cold tank thinking about, oh, nigga, fuck, man, if we got away, nigga, I'd have had a million dollars in whoop de whoop. That's a dumb way to think, because guess what? You sit in that motherfucking cold tank and you don't got a million dollars and you cooked. See, that's the dumb motherfucker thinking like that while he's already in the situation that he thought about that worked out wrong. But motherfuckers, I have to understand, people in this damn time, they do that. There's niggas, there's so niggas getting caught today thinking about, fuck, if the homie didn't do this, we would got away. First thing you should be thinking is that, nigga, why not do this in the first place? Anything on how you want to get it is through your mind, nigga. So you could have thought of a better mental way to get whatever you wanted. If you want 300000 nigga, right, nigga, you should be thinking of a better way to get it. How's the easiest way to get it? How's the way to get 300000 by not hurting and affecting other motherfuckers? The least way is possible. Without physically hurting motherfuckers. Without physically causing a brazy-ass situation. Niggas don't think about that. Yeah, you might do wrong, but have you ever thought about how to do wrong at least a little bit right? No. And none of it's right because you're doing wrong. But the thing about it is that you're trying to think about a better way to do even do wrong. But most motherfuckers, they stay slumped in the wrong way of doing wrong. And get washed the fuck up, blood. It's Diesel Talk. Boy, y'all like and subscribe to the channel. I'll tell you, G.O.D.R. will knock his out, man. On GLD, I will roll this stupid up. He playing. Come on, man. His ass playing, man. Yeah, you try to put what you put out. Like, nigga, I said, yeah, okay, he beat he GD, nigga. But I said, clearly, I don't even know them niggas. I'm not a tool with them niggas. You know what I'm saying? I'm yeah. not a tool with them. Yeah. What is that yeah. saying? Yeah, well, listen. You wrong. The whole world know this. You wrong. I always know. They're not going to get at the white boys like that. Always know that. Don't be the type of nigga to be like, oh, this white boy, nigga, culture, won't you do that? Motherfuckers is never going to motherfucking look at it like that from that perspective. They're not going to move accordingly. So that route of trying to like just take you, you did this, you did that, you did. That could be true. But trust me, you feel me? This is what the bullshit wants. They want a motherfucker from another race. This is what it, this is what it's. That's what it comes to. Videos and it is what it is. Boy, GD, look, 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 look. Like the whole world know that, guy. So it is what it is. Like I ain't finna be doing all this back and forth or, you know? Yeah, like, you it is. is what it is. Niggas see what what happened. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, some people ain't even read it. Like the way that they pick and choose, like somebody else do this bond and all this shit to come on the other side. They would come out, gang. They would come out, gang. They would. They do pick and choose, but you still did that. <laughs> but they do pick and choose, though. And, oh, people who are like niggas say something like niggas not even, they not even reading it. They just going off the title and they just actually going like, to like, put a rap. They can't wait to say that. They're like on GLD. A real rap folks is getting somebody sent to prison, gang. Yeah? No. Niggas get on the stand, get in the no, 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 no. Nah, I wait to say that, nah, man. that sound like a rat saying that. A real rat is a nigga that send a nigga to prison that get nigga off the streets, gang. Hell no, nigga. No. Nigga, on nigga, if I take that candy bar, nigga, you say I did it, nigga, you implement that I did it, nigga, what, you ratted on me, what the fuck? I, I may not go to prison. What the hell, see, that's what, 
That's why I fucked up, y'all. That's why I fucked all these blood. Fuck all these rules. Don't get into something where the rule, you be a motherfucking fool, blood. That's a fool dummy. Hey, sign me up. Sign me up. Sign me up. This is how it's going? Fucked up? I'm head first. And you dive into some bullshit? And you see his bullshit before you get in? No. I'm raising my voice with that one. You know I got a motherfucking big ass. Gorilla ass voice, boy. Hell nah. That's when niggas on my mama. I even be looking at niggas on my mama. Some niggas, niggas start banging niggas. Niggas that's 21, 22, 23. I be looking like, nah, this shit, blood. Nah, it's time to really... Right, it's time to Tupac this shit. Change this shit with your own mind. Not go with the flow of this shit, blood. Not go with the flow that's fucked up. And that's what we, a lot of us do this bangers. Nigga, we get put in position and niggas still, niggas gonna still, nigga, go with the flow of nigga banging. No, nigga, you gotta Tupac that shit, nigga. Fuck that. This, this is right, this is wrong. Nigga, we gonna do it like this. Woo, 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 woo. Most niggas don't have that within them. You feel me? Most motherfuckers don't have that within them, though. Let's listen to a little bit of this, though, still, though. Hold on. This the thing. A real rat folks is getting somebody sent to prison, man. No. Niggas getting on the stand, getting niggas freedom to. No. I've never in my life been on the stand, told them, man, that no. nobody freedom to nothing. No. I ain't going, I ain't going that. But yeah, oh, well, uh, this nigga, oh, uh, uh, 600 Breezy. What the f? Well, 600 Breezy, what happened? They, what happened with the altercation with them all? Nothing. He did it, yeah, he a bitty, but he ain't locked up. I ain't the tool, but he ain't no shit to nobody. You already that's talking to him, like, See, man. See, that's the point. Niggas is. This. 2000 man. million no. like, you know, two days ago. Like, come on, man. I can spit at the camera and get more views than that. I'm JLD. Six out of Breezy. Not doing nothing no more, man. Like, what are you doing? Like, these niggas is. Y'all should be proud and happy that. Right, and he's still gonna talk, remember. He's still gonna talk. And watch him, nothing ain't gonna happen. Watch, and if it do, you know, it shit. You know, it do. But it ain't gonna happen, watch. And watch, you feel me? That's why he's saying 600 Breezy, you know what I'm saying? Basically, nigga, you ain't been doing nothing. Nigga on the internet, nigga, I bet. Right, cause the nigga who made it, that is motherfucking miles, nigga, no matter what. It's Diesel Talk, boy, I'm gone, man. We gonna dissect this shit. I've been talking y'all's ear off, man. Y'all like and subscribe to the motherfucking channel. You know, we didn't even go through the whole thing. This is a motherfucking 50 minute interview. And there ain't, you know, we done basically heard out all the shit about King yelling this, that, and the other, man. Y'all let me know what y'all feel in the comments, man. You know, we dissecting this shit. We breaking it down. It's vomiting, boy.